Uh... What's up everybody, welcome to VX Gaming, hope you all had a good day, hope you all enjoyed your weekend, and today we're talking about South Park. Who doesn't love South Park? The creators of South Park have signed a new $900 million deal, and this deal includes a new game. Now from what I've been able to read, it doesn't sound like it's going to be a sequel to the Fractured Butthole and the Stick of Truth. It doesn't sound like it's going to be like that. Instead, it actually sounds a lot more like a classic South Park game, which might be remade or maybe just a new a new take on it or something like that. It sounds like they're going back to an old format, which they've done in the past, and it's a nostalgia trip. So let's read on and see what they're actually saying. But from what I can read so far, it doesn't sound like it's going to be a trilogy for the current iteration. So South Park creators Trey Parker and Matt Stone have inked a new $900 million deal that will see the duo creating several more series for the show, a bunch of new spin-off movies and a new video game. Now the deal with Viacom CBS will be paid out over the next 6 years, so I think it stands to reason that within the next 6 years we could see this game. Could. I keep on thinking about South Park, the stick of truth and how long that one took to get out, so you never know what's going to happen. But this is apparently one of the richest TV deals ever. Now well, the new seasons of the show and 14, yes 14, accompanying movies for Comedy Central will be released via Viacom's Paramount Plus streaming service between now and 2027. A 3D video game that is set in the world of South Park is also on the cards. Now this is according to a report from Bloomberg. Now, this is what I have in my mind. I'm going to be honest, or how many people remember that? That's a classic. Okay, it's a bit rough on the edges, it's a PS1 game, but it works. It's still a decent game. Now, is this the right move? I would give them a shot. I would, I would give them a shot. If it was a remake, roughly on the same basis as this, maybe. You know, I might actually consider it. A completely new game with a new story that's also taken on the aspects of that game, I think that would be pretty good. Now for people that don't understand, this game is actually, you can walk around the entire level and basically see characters and uh, fight a bunch of turkeys and all this, and clones, but it was also a first person shooter. So it might be decent. Might be, but for right now, is that what they're doing? That's what it kind of sounds like they're doing, to be honest. But it doesn't sound like they're going for a trilogy. A, a trilogy. It doesn't sound like it's going to be the same as Stick of Truth or the Fractured Butthole. It doesn't sound like it's going to be anything like that. So there is no mention of Ubisoft regarding this new South Park video game or whether it will be in the previous Ubisoft South Park efforts. Stick of Truth and the Fractured Butthole. So that's already a question mark. Those two games, yes, Stick of Truth took a long time to come out, but those two games are really, really good. Really, really fun. Okay, there's some questionable things in it, such as difficulty and the Fractured Butthole, but uh, what do you expect at South Park? But those games are really, really good. Going away from that format, which I think is probably a bad idea, let's see what happens. Now, however, it's certain that for the next six years at least, South Park isn't likely going to go anywhere. South Park pays the bills and then some, according to Matt Stone. Trey and I have used that to pay for other stuff we want to do. So it does sound like we are going to have a new South Park game in the future. It sounds like it is going to be something very similar to this, you know, gameplay style. Uh, looking at the back, hopefully a lot more better quality. It's a bit rough, let's put it that way. It's a bit rough. You know, the characters were never really circle, to be honest. They looked more like um, a potato. So, are you interested in this? I mean, obviously South Park is a fun series. They have some amazing, wacky moments. But given the success of the current two games that they have, Moving away from that format sounds like a bad idea to me. Going to be honest. Going back to a PS1 era style that they did in the past, 
questionable, but I'm actually kinda for it as well. I'm, I'll give them the benefit of the doubt for the moment, until we actually see some gameplay, until we see a trailer. We can't really comment other than that, can we? So until we finally see something along those lines, what can we say? So sound off in the comments below, like, comment, share, subscribe, stay on, stay safe, stay sane, go play a few games. If you have a PS1, then by all means, go play this. It's a fun game. I also have GTA in the back, so I might play that as well. But, sign up in the comments below, and I'll catch you all next time. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.